Vessels need constant feed of information. Everybody is going digital. S100 will make navigation safer. Optimizing the trade routes in Canada. The S-102 is mapping of the ocean floor, high-resolution bathymetry. For the benefit of bathymetric and hydrographic uh, layers, it's detailed knowledge of what's down there. Ships, they navigate everywhere. We need to support navigator with data that is coherent. Everybody uses charts. Everybody has their map on their phone. Even the fisherman has got some form of digital chart. The most privileged pilot that's already working with S-102, they don't want to go back. With a traditional EMC, you can see some contours. The darker blue is less safe than the lighter blue. White is very, very safe. Now, when you turn on the bathymetric data, you have more details. Blue is deep, green is starting to get shallower, and red, you're, you're getting into the danger zone. The pilot's community, they're really striving for the best uh, information, super precise information, because they are in charge of the most critical key areas in Canada. Halifax Harbour. If a ship were to run aground, depending on the severity, you're going to end up shutting down the port. You're going to have ecological problems. It would be disastrous for any major sized ship to run aground in this area. By making use of S-102 will provide greater safety. You're going to reduce the chance of a grounding, greater efficiency for the mariner traveling and saving even on emissions. And the efficiency of the turnaround time, of course, the carbon footprint will be a lot less. In terms of the science around it, there's basic parameters that are highly influences the, the living species in the water column. So bathymetry is essential. Getting high definition of the actual bathymetry of the bottom, that would add safety. S100 will make navigation safer in Canada and will boost efficiency. Mm -hmm.